Starting this past summer, the City of Athens collaborated with the Ohio Department of Transportation for a road improvement and widening project. This project, which cost $7.5 million, has forced the closure of the westbound lane of West Union Street from Schaefer Street to Ohio 682. The big challenge has been like, I'm just giving out hours. Um, it's really hard for me to hire somebody in and say, well, we're going to be busy here in like two months and I'll really need you, but I can't give any hours until then. Yeah. So it's really hard to do those things. So, um, you know, there's going to come a point where they're like, we're going to be done in five days and I'm going to have five days to hire 30 or 40 people mm -hmm. and train them and expect that they have, you know, appropriate training and, and things like that. The detour adds almost three extra miles to any route coming from the east side of the city. Well, it's probably about double the gas every time I go home because I used to just go down that road. Now I'm going all the way around. My personal commute would be uh, if I'm just coming to work and then going home, I would say um, it's about an additional like 15 to 20 minutes a day. Business owners on the torn up stretch of road have taken significant hits in their business figures due to the subsequent detour. At Larry's Doghouse, business is slow. We roughly used to get six to nine hundred orders a day and now we probably barely hit six every day. Sometimes we get over it, sometimes we barely hit 300, 400 worse. We've been growing steadily too since um, like since COVID. Um, like a good average for me to put up in growth. Like, like if I compare this week to last week in sales, um, it used to be, you know, I'm typical to seeing like 10 to 15% in growth is like, that's a pretty just steady average. Um, but we're like putting up like 25 to 35% decreases in comparison to last year. Looking at this like in like hindsight, I wish that um, they would have like planned to do this in sections as opposed to doing it um, like let's tear up all of this road that could have been being used, you know. If they just got this opened up to here, to us two way, and you left the rest one way, that's fine because there's all these other access points you can loop right back around, get right back to here to then go right. I'd say a difference would be with here in Stimson is that um, they have all of these side access streets that people could have used to kind of pop back over and jump this way or that way and get around. You don't have that here on West Union. For The Post, I'm Dan Gray.